mightiest oak must bend to the winds of fate. Hello toy fans, it's Chris from Chasing 80s Toys here and today we're talking about G.I. Joe and one particular figure we're going to talk about and that's Storm Shadow. Storm Shadow was one of my favorite characters on Cobra Team when I watched the Sunbow animation cartoon back in the 80s and I never had the Storm Shadow figure as a kid, bought this one later on. Um, I think he's a cool figure. I do prefer the version 2 Storm Shadow which later came out in the toy line. Love the camo, love the Arashikage tattoo that he has and he's part of the good guys at that point. But when Classified came out and I saw Storm Shadow, I thought this is pretty cool, I need to dive into that line. So I purchased a few of the figures over time, uh, I got some gifted. This Storm Shadow is one of them, thanks to Stu from Universal Toy Collector YouTube channel. Thanks again, Stu. And I never got around to unbox these figures. And the reason for that is space. There's an issue with having not enough shelf space to display all the toys we love. But that's changed. I've got a little bit of amount of free space and I figured I can display a few of my favorite classified figures on the shelf. And this is the first time for me, I believe, that I'm gonna unbox a six inch scale figure. So that's gonna be fun. Um, Storm Shadow seemed like the right place to start. So let's unbox Storm Shadow. But before we do that, I'm gonna give you another close up at this beautiful artwork on the box. Um, classified is a line I'm not gonna dive in too deeply. Um, I just collect whichever figures I like, so I'm not going to go for the complete lineup. Again, due to space and again, to the reason that I just collect whatever I think looks good. I think they did a good job with the artwork. Love all the figures that are around here and in the center of it. We have Storm Shadow and Snake Eyes facing off. And some artwork, Storm Shadow on the side of it. Really like that as well. And you can easily display these figures in the case if you want to. That's how I did it over time and I'm happy to say now due to getting a bit of extra shelf space I'm finally going to be able to unbox these figures and experience for the first time what it is about a six inch scale figure that collectors around me enjoyed so much. So I'm a bit late to the party with this but better late than never and with a bit of movie magic it's time to unbox Storm Shadow, and here he is. They look so cool, or they, at least Storm Shadow, the first one out, looks so cool. Finally released from his box and in that posing. Got the backpack with the arrows and the Arashikage symbol. Two sheets for the katanas. Definitely gonna display him holding his katanas like that. Comes with a few more accessories like the bow. And one of his arrows is loose so you can even display him holding the bow and arrow. There is an extra hood. You can. Uh, Take the head off, put the hood on, but I'm gonna display him like this because Vintage Storm Shadow looked like this, the Sunbow animation cartoony looked like this, so this is how he should look and that posing, I said it with Origin so many times, I think the same goes for these classified figures, it makes the posing the more dynamic. And that's what I like about this. Anyone can use a weapon, but the ninja is a weapon. As you can see behind Storm Shadow, there's a lot more I've collected and a few that were gifted by Stu that I'm going to unbox and put on the shelves. And maybe I can get a bit of more shelf space and a few more figures from the classified line because 
There's one figure in particular that just came out that I saw on uh, Ken's Toy Connections channel. Awesome channel, do check that out as well. And that was seeing Quick Kick coming down the line, so that's a cool figure. Bazooka, it's been out for a while, but that's another one that I'm definitely gonna add to the collection. And maybe, don't know if they've done Alpine already. Here's me dipping my toe into the classified toy line, and I hope you enjoyed this look at Storm Shadow with me. Thank you so much for watching. This was my look at Classified Storm Shadow. Hope you enjoyed it. And as always, Chasing 80s Toys will be back. So I hope to see each and every one of you on the next one. And do remember, the ninja is the weapon.